Now, yesterday, First News senior reporter Jerry Ricciuti featured the race for Common Pleas Judge in Mercer County. Tonight, he is live in the county with what is happening with the election. Let's go to Jerry. Stan, it appears that we will see three people running for those two seats left open through judge retirements here in Mahoning County. As you just mentioned, Margaret Lucas came in first on the Democratic ballot. Ron Amrine placed uh, within the running in both Republican and Democratic ballots. He placed number two on the Democratic ballot. We've learned he placed number one on the Republican ballot, followed by State Representative Ted Nesbitt. It will appear at this point, and that's barring the addition of absentee ballots later this week, provisionals, and any write-ins that there might have been that get counted. It appears Lucas, Amrine, and Nesbitt will face off against each other in the fall for those two seats that are up for grabs here in Mercer County. It also appears this was an easy evening for both incumbent and appointed District Attorney Pete Acker and Sheriff's Deputy Bruce Rosa, both of them appearing to win the Republican nominations fairly handily. We can also tell you that uh, incumbent McGonigal and McConnell and Boyd, the three existing Mahoning, or Mercer County commissioners, appeared to have won their nomination race along with Dr. Molitari. Those two, or rather four, two Democrats, two Republicans, will be facing each other now in the fall for those two existing, or rather three seats, that are up on the board of elect uh, uh, commissioners in Mercer County. We'll have more for you coming up at 11, including hopefully an interview with Ron Amrine. For now, though, live in Mercer, Jerry Ricciuti, WKBN 27 First News.